best of Texas drivers. Welcome back. I'm sure this is gonna be a guns ablazing kind of video. Best of Texas, either pegged or get pegged. You know, maybe I should try getting pegged sometime. Just to know what it feels like, you know? You guys ever wonder? You know what I mean? Like what like you're just like wondering. It's like, you know, what if the shoe was on the other foot? You know? What would that be like? I've never wondered. No? Don't knock it till you try it. That's what I'm saying. See, that's what I'm saying. You'd finally let Amy peg you? Uh, maybe. We'll see. If she's down, let's try it. You know? You never know. Might be good. Don't knock it till you try it, chat. Dude, I'm, like, there's probably plenty of dudes out there that love getting pegged. Like, they, they, they must know something I don't know, right? They probably know something I don't know. Guys, hope you'll enjoy today's video too. Stay safe. Oh, uh, wait, but YouTube, uh, <clears throat> hey, YouTube, please don't age restrict me. I've been a good boy. I know the beginning of the stream was me talking about getting pegged, but god damn it. What the fuck? What? He made a left turn across three lanes and then turned left. Where is bro going? Dash cam. <clears throat> Cop just left too. You guys okay? Other driver did a U-turn, then went into my lane and slammed on the brakes. He's practicing serpentine. Oh, what the f- what the f what? And that's why you never road rage, chat. That's why. Bro pulled out a whole fucking assault rifle. Oh, dude, it's got a scope and everything. Holy shit. That thing's kitted out. Bro's playing GTA in real life. Dude, he pulled out. Is that two different guns? Did he, does he just have an arsenal in his car? That That's two different guns, right? The one with the long barrel. Yeah, the one with the long barrel. It's black with the scope. He's going back for number two. It has camo. Camo. Uh, smaller barrel. Has he got another one? Flash's rifle. He threw the middle finger. Wow. He's just showing him off. Yeah. That was a good left turn. That's a good left turn. <clears throat> All right. Classic. Classic truck getting. <laughs> He was so quick to get out of his truck, man. That is the most Texas-looking guy I've ever seen. Dude, he even walks like he's from Texas. <clears throat> Man's got that GTA loadout. Dude, that is, that is the most threatening dude I've ever seen. We both attempted to merge into the same lane. Firepower systems, employee assaulting motorists. to cause collision. Mortars called 911. What? Firepower systems employee assaulting motorists. And... Oh, the motorist is the guy who submitted the video, right? I was confused on what that was saying. 
por ejemplo, reducir las calorías, hacer ayuno intermitente o bajar la cantidad de carbohidratos que tenés en tu dieta, que representan un estrés para tu cuerpo. Pensaros como algo que gasta fuerza de voluntad, algo que de primera a tu sustancias que causan inflamación, como los alimentos que me generan wow. alergia, o simplemente una mala dieta en la que consumo alimentos que ni siquiera oh my God. conoce como los alimentos, puede aumentar el estrés en mi Dude, the guy in the truck, he's just, oh God. causar más inflamación e incluso impactar negativamente en la fuerza de voluntad. Con lo cual, si bien no es la que la tiene fer, quizás tu dieta esté impactando negativamente en tu fuerza de voluntad, y esto puede suceder porque llevas just una dieta turn up más your music? That's what I'm saying. Like, just, I don't know. I'll never understand people who um normal do that shit mis alérgenos o porque comes con mal estado is this semi gonna merge over what's up oh oh he's pit maneuvering him he's pit maneuvering him Oh God! The fuck! <clears throat> That's why you stay away from semis, dude. Does anyone do this thing where, whenever you pass the semi, like you don't like slowly pass the semi? What I do. All right. That's what I do, right? Here's the interstate. There's a big ass semi right here. I always hang like right here. Like say, that, say there's a car right here, right? I hang right here. Until the car gets far enough or goes over and then I just floor it. Past the semi. Like as fast. Like I just get out of there. As fast as I can. I never hover. Like literally. I'm too afraid to hover next to a semi like that. Shit's too. It's just too sketchy. You never know. My drawings are getting so advanced. I mean. I've been practicing. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, that evasive maneuver. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dude, shut up. You weren't in the accident. You were just watching. Chill out. Yeah. That, was, that was good. That was a good maneuver, though. Oof. Get. This is not their environment, right? Dude, why is there so many fucking Joe Rogan listeners? Oh, wait, we're in Texas. What am I talking about? Well, I mean, in general, we have so many uh, uh, in all of these fucking videos. There's so many people listening to Joe Rogan's podcast. I know it's Texas. I'm saying in general, we like a lot of these dash cam videos. We've heard so much Joe Rogan. What? These guys were. Pulling out a snake. Oh, no, they they got trouble. Something happened. Like, it's at a pet store. Killing over like, 300. Three people going the wrong way out of an entrance. One notices, but. Uh, they, they, they killed the wrong one or something like that. One of these uh -oh. pregnant had like 50. Uh oh! Out of it or Dude! Dude. So why they... Wow. These things. Uh, That's, that was the only guy who noticed. And ironically, he didn't notice the car behind him. As we just announced, we are proud to be the official healthcare providers of the Fighting Texas Aggies. Because it's more than just delivering exceptional health. I mean, I get, I get what that guy was doing. I assumed what this guy was hoping for. Aggies. He saw a yellow light on that side, and he's thinking, oh, this truck's obviously going to slow down, right? But you forget, it's a pickup truck. Because it's more than just delivering exceptional. I mean, it's still a yellow light. R regardless, this guy's in the wrong, but I get what he was trying to do. Super late breaking, too, yeah. Dude, just slow a bit. Yeah, he probably just wasn't paying attention, to be honest. Fucking. Fucking bug. Oh, right, what?
double left well, awesome. turn in side lane. Well, I don't do my iconic victory dance for nothing. Okay, I guess just this once I can do it for nothing. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dude, what is okay, this? Okay, I guess I can do one more for nothing. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Like, what is, what is that? The fuck is that thing? And how is it even a Tangia thing? Gwimbly's victory dance. Who the fuck is Gwimbly? Oh, it's a Smiling Friends character? Oh, okay. I haven't watched Smiling Friends yet. I don't know why. I genuinely don't know why. I probably would love this show. Turn left onto Elm Street. Drive. Dude, he, he's, he's got... He's got a convertible, all right? Don't fuck with him. He's cooler than all of you. Got my first idiot after getting a dash cam. Thankfully, the only damage was two egos. I'll finger all this. That's true. Figured if I got if he got that upset over a horn honk, engaging him any further wasn't gonna help. Very true. Smart. Smart. What what were they doing? Were they swapping drivers? Like were they about to kiss? Like I Okay, I mean, to be honest, you should have seen that guy coming, like. Like, you, I don't know. The, to be fair, if this guy was paying attention, he probably would have been able, he probably would have been fine right here. But he had to be like, no, my lane. I mean, the idiot, the dude, uh, the dude's obviously an idiot for swapping two lanes. But I'm like, there's so much, there's ample time to react to this. Like, right here, you can break. But bro kept going. He's like, my lane! Like Eskimo His last two brain cells are fighting for what to do. Danny tramped over there, squatted, and began to dig. Before long, he had uncovered the dark mouth of one of them, and he slipped into the cold tunnel. In his mind, he Not was the wheelbarrow! The, room, the secret agent man. They had shown the reruns of that program twice on the Burlington TV channel, and his daddy never missed them. He would skip a party to stay home and watch CBS. Oh, that sucks. That's on a one-way road, too. Pick up Miami didn't stop. He had insurance. Uh, yo, Spoops, thank you so much for becoming a member. Uh, Anu, Anu, thank you so much for the 300 bits. Is that Nick Offerman? Wait a second, was that? The Burlington TV channel, and his daddy never missed them. No, that's not Nick Offerman. <laughs> that's a goddamn F-250 right there, if I've ever seen one. You brake checking? In the fast lane? Should have had a better truck, true. <clears throat> Smiling friends, watch it now. Can't. Streaming. My God, dude! Like this, this bro even has a nice car, and he and he's out here doing shit like this. Oh boy, I wonder who would be at fault in this situation. I love, dude. Look, look at that smirk. Look at that smirk. Like I got him. <laughs> I'm calling the cops now. I got him. <laughs> Can't wait to get a brand new car because of this. Holy fuck! Jesus. Oh, yeah, see? See? See, that's what I'm afraid of with semis. Can we bring up, where is it at? See, that, yeah. That's what, see, about if I'm right here, if semi merges and I'm in his blind spot, yeah, that's what, yeah. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. $10 from Spoops. 
Been a fan for a long time. It's great to see you doing well. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the 10. I appreciate it. Car wreck new Ford Explorer makes me sick. Huh? Oh. Yo, two dollars from a Sydney. I've been watching videos for a while. Thank you, Pink. Thank you. Thank you. Fun fact: Socrates said, "You are what you habitually do." Plato responded, "I guess that Yo, makes me right? your mom." Yo, and high fived Aristotle. That was epic, Carl. Thank you so much. Also. I don't understand the concept of, oh, there's two trucks in front of me that are swerving around and being assholes. I have an idea. I'm in a motorcycle. What the hell are you talking Let's drive up really close to the guys and see what's going on, you know? Whoa. What the f like, why are, you, why are you getting, get out of there, man. Get out of there. Like, go, go to the right side. And get out of there. What are you doing? He was breaking a lot at least. Yeah, he was breaking a lot and then decided to speed up towards them. Like what? Two trucks having sex? That's that's what he's thinking on the motorcycle. Oh, I got to get a closer view. Two trucks doing it. Yeah. Wait, is the motorcycle brake checking him? Oh my god, the motorcycle was actually brake checking the guy. Oh my god. I don't think I don't think there's something dumber you could possibly do. Wow. Like what? Why? I don't like, I don't get it. The motorcycle wasn't even a part of the road rage. Like, the motorcycle was in the clear. Thank you, Loki's Curse. And those, these are probably the same dudes. It's like, you guys need to watch out for motorcycles. And then proceeds to do dumb shit like this. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, people need to watch out for motorcycles who are driving safe. Not fucking <laughs> this loser. Who's literally brake checking a fucking truck. Was trying to be a hero and stop the fight, LOL. That's not being a hero. That's being a complete idiot. Oh, there's two, there's two death, uh, death squares of metal that could kill me very easily in a fight. Let's go over there. Like, break up what fight between two trucks? Like, I, yeah, I, I don't understand what his logic was, to be honest. Cleveland? That's not in Texas. Is there a Cleveland, Texas? I I want my money back. I want I want my video back. No. Nope. Cleveland Family Guy? Yeah. I don't know if that's copyrighted. Classic. You know, after watching this for a long time, I've noticed, like, uh, so many patterns. I've noticed that left turns at intersections are probably the most dangerous thing ever in the world to do. You need to be hyper vigilant every time you make a left turn at any intersection or a left turn at, honestly, a left turn anywhere, it feels like. Also, not only that, but the person driving towards the person who's turning left are is the most dangerous shit ever. Like, left turns are the main source of pain and suffering. Focus, like, pay attention to them. I ate left turns, yeah. I didn't even see what happened. I mean, dude just pulled out in front. But like, th this, this, for example. You see a dude in the left turn lane? Hyper-focus on that guy because he's gonna do something stupid like this. Yeah. 
Write that down, chat. Roundabout on top. Yeah, chat. There's no left turns in a roundabout. There's no left turns in a roundabout. I mean, unless you're in UK, which UK doesn't count because it's the opposite. No left turns in a roundabout. It's all lefts in the fucking UK. Idiot. You turn right into the roundabout. Yeah, when you're in the roundabout, you're going in a circle. Technically, it's a left turn, but the turn is just right. You turn right into it. And then you follow the roundabout. I don't consider you going in the roundabout the left turn. That's not how it works. You're gonna fit. Oh my god. I, I don't even want to watch this. I don't want to watch this. Train crossing still down after an hour. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That scared me. Okay, that scared me. All right. Crazy ass day. My brother worked there as a different guy. You different guy. What the, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the goddamn hell's going on here? Black car tries to stop traffic, not a cop. Left turn Hello. moment, left turn. Go. Oh. You're already through the light. And then you have people like this. Your streams are really perfect for people who can't sleep or Batman, the city needs me. Are you saying I'm Batman? Am I, am I, am I Batman? You think I'm Batman? I've never driven in a roundabout. It's really easy and cool. You should try it sometime. Jesus Christ. I can I can explain in detail why roundabouts are so much better. You guys want me to do it again? I can't. And guess what? I still have idiots. I still have idiots telling me that I'm wrong. Do it. I'm right. You know, let's watch a video about this. I don't know, but I hope he stubs his big toe on a door jam when he gets home. Of everyone on the shoulder and got to me and started pushing me over. Okay. It's a goddamn Ford F-150. He's got the American flag sticker on there. Goddamn. Why? What, are you trying to pass? Oh, it's, oh, this guy's pushing you over. Oh, it's not the F-150 that's the problem. I got distracted because it's the F-150. It's just a dumbass trying to push him over. This is what that fucking semi did that one time. I hate people that drive like the cam guy. I mean, he should have just gave up and pulled back. But yeah, like, regardless. You want to run somebody off the road? You want to run somebody off the road? Huh? Yeah, good. Good. Want to get the picture of the driver when I file the police report? Yeah. Yeah. You tell him. You tell him. In, in 1981, two years before... Is that Ben Shapiro and Joe Rogan? 1981, two years before... declined throughout the mid 1980s. Scott claims that he was denied of a promotion because of diversity in 1986. Dude, like it's it's Texas or is that Tucker? It is a little bit sped up. Maybe that's Tucker. Shut up! Oh my god, I don't care. Scott claims that he was denied of a promotion because of diversity in 1986. Maybe that's Tucker Carlson. Yo, thank you, Air Bear, for the ten dollars. Hold on, if you're going around a roundabout and you turn right into it and follow it left with your wheel turned left, how is that not a left turn? You know, I'm now I'm not, I don't have to explain myself because the only turns that you make is right. Turning is implying that you are changing a lane or going somewhere else. It's not a left turn. 
if you are just driving on a road. And then you want to know how you get off of the, the roundabout is you turn right again. Right turn into circle, that's the turn because you're changing lanes. You're driving on the road. It's the equivalent of having like a left a left swerve. You know, like you're driving on a road and it has like swerves and stuff. It's like a left bend, a left bend on a road, right? That's not a turn, that's a bend. Are you a road nerd? Yeah, dude, I fucking watch stupid videos all day of idiots in cars. I, I, at this point, I am a road nerd. That was scary though. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, we cut him off. Okay. I, I was more scared that it was gonna hit the bridge. Bro, like, what? What? <laughs> what the fuck? He just said, you know, fuck it, I'm going. I don't even care, man. How's the stream going? Fantastic. Watch boat crash videos sometime? Maybe next stream. What the fuck? And apparently an unstable woman tried to block me in a parking lot when I left. She chased me, cut me, cut in front, causing a crash. She was charged with reckless driving and falsifying a police report. And insurance denied her claim. Ha! Idiot! That's why you guys need to get a dash cam. I don't have a dash cam. I should probably get a dash cam. I have one? Good. Left turn? No? Okay, just an idiot. Oh, that was... That wasn't really worth saving the video of. I guess to show your friends. I don't know. Is this the same guy? It's just a bunch of the same guy. Okay, Garmin, save video. Like any minor inconvenience on the road? Okay, Garmin. Ready, chat? Say it together. Say it together, chat. Ready? Okay, Garmin. Okay, Garmin. Save, video. save the video. All right, ready? All together, guys. Come on, ready? All together. One, two. Oh, what? Okay, Garmin. Okay, Garmin. Uh, okay, Garmin. Save, the save the video. There we go. There we go, chat. All right, ready? Ready? We're going to do it again. Everybody get ready. Garmin. It's Garmin. All right? Okay, okay Garmin. Garmin. There it is. Wait. Okay, Garmin. Okay, Garmin. Okay, Garmin. Okay, Garmin. Save, the Save the video. He's listening to an anime intro? Like, what the fuck is that? Garfield saved the video? Close. Freaking idiot! Freaking idiot! <coughs> I stopped the light. The woman behind me didn't like that, so she gets right on my bumper and proceeds to sound her horn while as we wait. Classic. What's with the... What's with that? What's going on there? What does that mean? Temporary license plate or something? That's a temp? Okay.
I was just confused because it looked like there was a license plate under it. Guys, who's in Paris? Chat, who's in Paris? Idiot truck driver doesn't know how to... The French? Oh, okay. Oh! Garmin, save the video. Blake Ruthless, dude. That's that's a badass name. How ruthless. Yep, left turn moment. Left turn moment. Don't fight it! Don't fight it! Yeah, okay, honestly, you were kind of being a dick. Like, let's be real. The driver, like... If you see that, just let him go. What's the point of, like, shoving your car onto the fucking... Why? Why go to the shoulder for that? Why are you driving in the crash lane? Is that what you call it? The crash lane? My shoulder! My shoulder! Left turn! Okay, what the fuck? Like, did, did you- How did you not see that? Like, slam on your brakes now! I mean, might have just not been paying attention, but... Don't get me wrong, once again, this dude's an idiot, but also, pay attention to the road. Yeah, he didn't break once. Guys, pay attention to the damn road. Are they racing? What is happening here? The fuck? Some rich-ass apartment buildings. Guy sideswiped me and ran. He clearly was fleeing, but the police said he would not be charged after they found him because I told them where he was hiding and he cooperated then. I used to live in Texas and people are for real so car centric and territorial and egotistical. It's kind of yucky. See, in my area, it's more like trucks specifically are like that. You know, trucks are like that's their main bread and butter is being like, I'm not giving up my lane. No matter what, I'm not giving up my lane. You know what I mean? For someone who has already been president. Bob. And who imposed tariffs. And Bob! Farmers, oh, Bob! Other farmers. Holy not shit. farmers necessarily, but other farmers. Oh, God. Pay attention! Sure. Jesus! Again, pay attention! Oh! Oof! Sleepy drivers? <clears throat> you, you know what's interesting about, like, um... Uh, someone made a really good point. Uh, when I was, uh, you know, researching stuff about motorcycle safety or whatever, uh, they were saying that we are doing everything in our power to make bad drivers safe instead of just making good drivers. You know what I mean? Like we're, we're moving on to like, you know, driving assist to uh, auto driving and AI driving and stuff like that. And we're just worrying about, I mean, don't get me wrong, safety is good. But we're, like, doing all these extra things to just, like, uh, you know, make it to where bad drivers will survive being bad drivers. Instead of just making people better drivers. You know what I mean? Like, why, why don't we have way more advanced courses for driving? Why don't we have to pass like very specific difficult things in order to get a license. There are places that don't even have, you, you don't even have to take a fucking class. You just turn 16, you go in and get your license.
And then it's up to you to figure out how to drive or it's up to your parents to figure out how to drive. Pig back in my day moment. It's not a back in my day moment. It's a today moment. This is a today moment. Like there are horrible drivers and like there's, I don't know. I feel like, you know, all of the terrible, I mean, we watch these videos all the time. 99.999% of the time, it's the driver's fault. You know what I mean? They're just bad drivers. They're not paying attention. Like even when people are pulling out in front of people, they have ample time to stop. They're just not paying attention. They're not looking at the road. They're not expecting something bad to happen. They're just, you know, like just casually driving down the road, not paying attention, looking at your phone, eating something. You know what I mean? Like the roads would be way safer if we had better drivers rather than having better safety, if that makes sense. Like, hell, everyone could be driving around, like, really unsafe cars, but if all of them just drove the speed limit, or I should say go with the flow of traffic, pay attention to the roads, follow the safety laws, and are just decent drivers, then there would be way less crashes. But I feel like we don't take enough um, precautions when it comes to teaching people how to drive. Like, look at teen drivers, dude. The amount of deaths in teen drivers is insane. And it's not really the car's fault. <laughs> that's for sure. Too many people that I've known that drive with no license usually because they racked up too many DUIs and it's honestly, it terrifies me. That too. Like, where I lived, DUI, or like driving under the influence was common. Like, booze cruising, that was a normal thing that, like, a lot of people did. A lot. And there's people I knew that fucking died in car accidents because of booze cruising. You know? Like, it, but it was so normalized back then. And then people grow up with that and then think this is normal. They stay in their town. They think it's normalized. Everyone does it. And then people die. Like, it's insanity. Wait, what what is this? It that's that's bowling for soup. Fuck, what is it called? Damn it. High school never ends, yeah. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Is it that one? Yeah. Classic. <clears throat> yeah, I used to fuck with that song too. See what I mean? Car in front of me belonged to a pregnant woman. Oh, God. Originally, the other driver accepted responsibility, but now it seems that they're disputing the accident 10 months later. I mean, again, if either of them paid attention, you know what I mean? That's that's what all of these come down to. Poser? Just because they didn't remember the title? Bro. Oh. Was that a Tame Impala? I've heard that song. Rear end. Dude, now I'm just focusing on the soundtrack that they're listening to at this point. So I had to jump across a solid white line into my lane and stop. Yeah, I... Have we seen this? Oh! Jesus Christ. Ford Focus proceeded through a stop sign. My son did not have a stop sign and was going the posted speed limit. He couldn't stop at time and hit, and hit the rear of the car. <clears throat> See, that's why you got to expect everyone to be an absolute idiot and asshole all the time. That's what makes you a good driver. <laughs> that as Chat, if you live life driving, expecting everyone to do the dumbest thing ever all the time, then your life will probably be better and you and you'll be way uh better at handling situations like this. Drive proactively, not reactively, exactly. 
Because I, I also was like researching this stuff about, you know, breaking and stuff and the huge difference between I reacting agree, pig, to breaking. But that means investing money into public transportation for meat bags who can't drive. Us robots have to babysit humans so they don't crash into each other. I mean, public public uh, uh, public transit should be a way, way bigger deal. It should put way more money into that. That would save, that would save traffic. That would save uh, accidents. Like the list goes on of how good that would be. Whoa. Like they put these giant pieces of metal on the on the road, and it's just one person most of the time in each car. Fly things or something. Holy shit! Holy. Oh, I was wondering why he swerved. Fuck that guy. Mm. <clears throat> oh, I mean, does it is he going too fast for this? This feels like he's going too fast for this. At least for my taste. I would not be going that fast in that area. He stopped the time, though. That's good. Oh, that's a lot of traffic. Oh! <laughs> what? Well, he was in the left turn lane. He was in the left turn lane, and then he turned right. What the fuck? Wow. Like, just do the stupid thing you're going to do and get the fuck out of the way. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, he held that shit together. Damn. Damn, that's clean. That's why ABS is really good on motorcycles, though, so you don't lock up like that. He almost had to lay her down. He held that pretty solid, though. Almost had to lay her down. <laughs> Dude. I love how you could just tell this is not the first time this guy's done it. Yo, Miss Pixel, thank you so much for the tier one. But look at this. This is probably not the first time this has happened to this guy. Like, <laughs> I love how you can just tell. Oh, oh, drift it, watch it, watch it. drift it. Tokyo drift it. Get it back, baby. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Every time I see that, I I just want to see him drift, man. I just want to see him drift and pull it back. Some baby driver type shit. What an idiot. Left turn moment. Left turn moment. Oh, God. What's going to happen? Oh. Uh. Oh, it's a co-worker. That's awkward. Oh, shit. I mean, just don't get close to the guy. I mean, that was... That was goofy. That was goofy. Cue the F-150 means, dude, this, is, this has been a pretty dead Tangia. I mean, the last two streams have been pretty dead for Tangia. Should I lower it back down? Maybe I made it too high. It's almost quiet in here. You know? So it's almost like quiet. Oh! Okay. 
Surprised he doesn't have balls on these truck. <clears throat> it makes the YouTube videos better like this? True. Sure is quiet tonight. Don't even know what the girl's thought process was. Proceeds to just cut across two lanes after he honks at the guy. I just get to the highway and speeding. There's a Yukon approaching the left, but not as fast as I. So I turn on my blinker to get the left lane. The guy speeds up, so I can't. Dude, I don't like what is the dick sizing contest when it comes to this? Like, do you guys ever notice where people are just like, like they think they're in a race? Like when people almost get insulted when someone passes them. You know what I mean? You thought you could pass me? Who do you think you are? Do you have any idea who I am? And you just passed me? These streets have been so much nicer. I want to hear Pig not talk, not some shitty sound effect. Thank you. You guys actually like hearing me talk? <laughs> Why'd you put the mute emote? Occasionally? Sometimes? Then why do you fun want to? fact. Cheaper tangia means more Carl fun facts. By the way, a midlife crisis could happen at any time. The sun isn't renewable energy because it's going to burn out. What are you implying when you said that midlife crisis could happen at any time? What are you implying, Carl? Jesus Christ! Because you can die at any age? I mean, well, yeah. <clears throat> Pig fucking autocorrect. Wait. I pass Hom again? He must rely, not have liked that now he passes me on the shoulder dangerously close to a side swipe is that what you mean you know damn well what carl was talking about what is carl talking about then huh huh that is your guys's favorite conversation is death you know let's let's talk about existentialism a little bit chat you know why are we here does any of this matter should we all commit ego death you know? Think about it, chat. Let's just all commit ego death. It's that simple. <clears throat> Please, no. I don't know what ego death is. It's where, you, it's where you kill off your ego and you lose your sense of self. So basically, you don't think of yourself as like a separate entity or like you, you don't think of yourself as like your own person. You think of yourself of, oh, I am skin and bones. I, I have a liver and heart and lungs and stomach. I am an organism that will walk through life and die someday. Isn't that fun? Isn't that fun, guys? Then you never have to worry about life's troubles. Because you won't have any fear of what people think about you because you'll lose your sense of self. Isn't that great? That's exactly what I need before work. Can we go back to talking about pegging? Your bones are wet. Very true. Now it's time to walk away. I hope you enjoyed your stay. Did you laugh or cry or maybe subscribed? I'll thank you either way. You know I will miss you. I hope you return. 
tell your friend or your mother to get me more views, please.